Um, oh. Yeah. That was cute. We're doing twin things already. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, guys? My name's Ariana. And I'm Maple. And today we're watching The Legend of Korra, season four, episode 12. So unserious, so I know. <laughs> the day of the Colossus? I hate that. <laughs> wow. Go ahead, take your time. Just bending a giant wall. Man, we got a lot of people here. Is that everybody? He like somehow makes light of the most stressful situation. Damn, that machine almost looked like it was cheeked up. Kuvira is heading away <laughs> with a platoon of mecha suits. What should we do? <laughs> this is my hometown, and I hate to say it, but let her take the city for now. We'll think of some way to come back and beat her. What about all the people who haven't been evacuated yet? I couldn't stop Kuvira from taking Zaufu. I'm not letting her conquer Republic City. The world isn't safe as long as she has that weapon. I agree. We take down that giant today. Well, you benders are gonna have to fight her alone. She just blew up our factory with all our hummingbird suits. Not all of them. There are the prototypes back at my office. If we can get those ready to fly, we'll at least be able to offer a little air support. Get those suits working as soon as you can. The rest of us will just have to face Kuvira on our own. A paint store? That's it. What are you doing, Milo? I just got an idea how to beat the giant. Now everyone, grab some paint and find me some balloons. Yeah, she probably didn't install windshield wipers on that thing, so. Oh, like little jelly bats. Airbenders approaching. I see them. You're really gonna shoot them, you fucking bitch. She's so fucking stupid. They're I'm literally sorry. like half of them are children. Children, literally, like you psycho. Milo's so smart. Clear the glass. The joints are platinum too. We can't metal bend any of it. You're about to get the world's longest hot foot, metal lady. This is sick. That, I'm, yeah. I'm. I'm stressed. My shoulder hurts. Ugh. <laughs> uh. Um, really? Just lay the f down, Kavira. She better like, not she really shoot. doesn't care. She's like, let's just let the world burn. Yeah, also better not shoot that too far into space because now and then we'll have like space problems. Oh, ball. oh no. I just don't know. How are they gonna? Somebody needs to like literally rip her head Take off of her body. Office. This is crazy. Like, <laughs> All right, let's fire it up again. I thought you fixed the hydraulics. I did. Ah! Oh no. I hope you have something in here that can take out a platoon of mecha suits. Kufira's troops are headed this way. I know how to take down some mecha suits, and it just might take down that <clears throat> giant too. Disconnect anything electrical in here until we get back. Julie, let's go. Julie, I've been thinking. Lately, I've been thinking about you. I know we might not make it out of this mess, and I feel like there are some things I should tell you. There are? I remember when I was a boy, and I had an ostrich horse. I feel like they just named keep her Mrs. Beaks. Winding her up, up on for a nothing. Farm. Did I ever tell you that, Julie? I loved old Mrs. Beaks, but I took her for granted. You'll have to finish your story later. Kuvira's troops are in range. Okay, I hope this works. Yeah, hit him with that electromagnetic frequency. Yes. Dead in their tracks. Oh, rats. She's still coming. Julie, do the thing. 
I'm afraid there are no more things to do. What was that? An electromagnetic okay. pulse. It shut down the mecha suits, but our power source is fine. Locate the source of the pulse. That must be where Varric is. This is Varric, like how come your electro thing. You shut down the small mecha suits, but not the big one. Because it's powered with spirit vine energy. I'm sorry. I wish I could help you, but it's unstoppable. Yeah. It's not. Dad? I figured we need all the geniuses we can get our hands on right now. I know what you all must think of me. But I love Republic City, and I would do anything to save her. You think you know how to defeat this thing? You must act like an infection. Break the skin and attack the vital organs. How are we supposed to get inside? Future Industries has plasma saws for cutting platinum. If we had one on the mecha suit... But the saws are way too big. I think I can add an electrical element to the welding torch on your suit and convert it into a plasma saw. Then we'll just have huh. to land on the giant and cut open a hole big enough for someone to get in. Like a metal mosquito. You know what happens to mosquitoes that land on me? I squash them. We'll have to attack in a swarm to try to keep you guys safe in the hummingbird suits. Mech platoons, report. Third platoon, no sign of anyone so far. I think we found the source of the electromagnetic pulse. Future Industries Tower. That's the place. Kuvira is headed our way. How long will it take to get the plasma saws ready? Just a few more minutes. Get out there as soon as you can. If you do manage to get inside, find the engine room. There are two emergency levers. If you switch them off at the same time, you'll cut the power. We may not be able to beat that thing, but we can slow it down. Let's go! Ugh. Again, like you're just gonna shoot the avatar? Like... She's a menace. That was, that, I mean. <laughs> He's so funny. He is so. <gasps> He's gonna <laughs> fart. No, okay. Oh, how sweet he saved his dad. Okay, watch out guys. That thing just does not quit. Oh my god, girl! She needs like a hobby. Yeah. Or something. If we stop that mecha giant, it will all be because of you. You're the one who designed these incredible suits. Okay, a little redemption for... It's great to be working together again. For dad. I love you, dad. I love you too. Just don't be evil again, Dad. Yeah. Julie. Yes. She's so hot. Like, like I come need on. To attach before we take off. Like, attach to what? I need to attach this ring to your finger. Will you do the thing for the rest of our lives? We just go from like, can't even say anything to yes. Mm. Being engaged. Go attach these barely that rust bucket killer smashing machine. It's exactly how I always pictured our engagement. <laughs> See, like a great couple's costume. Dang. Aim for that spot in the middle. You of gotta be quicker than that. I can never reach. Got it. <laughs> My God. I wish I had that kind of flexibility. Ugh. Is there any way to distract her? She's gonna bend the water or something. What is she I doing? I think. Ooh, the anticipation is killing me. I feel like for the most part, I've been like fairly silent because it's been like, oh. Oh shoot. <clears throat> I 
Get it. Power. They're cutting in. This Tommy, I'm scared. Is it her dad too? We need to get out of here. Almost there. <gasps> we have to go now. Is her dad going to die? I don't know. Dad, now. Goodbye, Asami. Oh, <gasps> no. What? The Roshi's plan worked. There's our opening. They literally just crushed that man. I hate, I love a redemption arc, but that's my least favorite redemption arc. Yeah, like you can't just <laughs> kill him right after. Like, Asami's been trying to like reconcile like her relationship this whole time. Like, this she... whole time. Like, even going to see him in prison and like trying to play a game with him and like. Yeah. That's, that's really fucked up. up. It's really fucked up. That's fucked up. Holy shit. And Sayad. And I hate Kavira. Like, she's probably, like, I had respect <clears throat> for Sahir. You know, like, this bitch is just a monster. She's just a monster. It, it's just it's past making sense. I'm so mad. Like, she's just. She's got issues. She's got issues. So. Um, I need the next episode, so... So we yeah. can wrap this up and hopefully put that bitch in the grind. I think she should be decapitated. She said that with her whole chest. Personally. I think her head needs to be fully detached from her body. Like, she can't... Because the thing is, is, like, what if there's, like, a zombie apocalypse? Are we, we going to deal with zombie Kavira? Like, I don't have time for that. Like, you need to just clean cut. She said, what if there's Roll a that head. No, I'm thinking, you know, like, you got to think ahead, dude. Like, do you want to deal with that later on if something happens or? No. Yeah, I, get, exactly. I, I see it. Just nip that in the bud. Yeah, just get it. It's incinerate that lady. So we're here hoping that Kavir is incinerated and decapitated. So yeah, let's get on to the next one and see if we're right. <laughs> okay. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. <laughs>